Hey everybody, uh, I just picked up some dinner from my favorite local pizza place here in Austin. So I thought I'd uh, use this opportunity to do a uh, little local review kind of a thing. So uh, sort of a free promotion for local places I like, or you know, maybe talking about some I don't like. <laughs> this is uh, this one is about Manja Pizza. Now Manja Pizza is a local, I believe it's a yeah, a local Austin originated pizza place that does Chicago deep dish pizza. Now they have regular pizza, but their main thing is Chicago deep dish. And this is not going to be like my first time trying it. This is just me, you know, giving a free plug because I like it. Um, and uh, today I did tr pick up something new. They have a lunch special there. I usually get this individual, uh, like this one person, uh, Chicago style little pizza. And I'll show you that right now. But they have a lunch special right now where you can get a, uh, if, a side with that, a side item, which I got their manja fries, which they're supposed to be very well known for. I've never tried any of their side items, but uh, the uh, manja fries and the pizza at the lunch special, it's actually cheaper than just getting the pizza itself. And uh, the total came out to like 866. So if I had just gotten just the pizza right here, it would have been a little bit more. Now this is a manja deep dish Chicago style pizza. And uh, it normally does not have Parmesan cheese all over it. I'm pretty uh, pretty heavy with a Parmesan when I get some pizza. Normally it's just the red sauce is all you'll see on the top of the pizza. A couple of pepperoni stuck in there. This is the carnivore. So this is the meat lover version of their Chicago style pizza. And like I said, got the side item, the manja fries, which I have not yet tried. And they come with a little special like manja sauce, which I thought was just going to be the marinara, but it's actually some kind of white sauce. I'm always a little hesitant with white sauces because I don't eat mayonnaise. Um, but I'm going to give it a try. I'm going to test out these manja fries. Now, this place, uh, I think there's two locations. Yeah, actually, it's right here on this cup. And I got this cup for free because they're so nice there that I was waiting for my pizza like one night and they just like gave me a free drink while I was waiting. They were about to close. They didn't have to, you know, be so nice. They're really nice. So, uh, yeah, they have two locations. One is Gracie Farms, which is right here in North Austin, right off Mopac, really close to where I live. So that's where I go. Then they have one on Mesa Drive, which I don't really know where that is. I don't know all of Austin that well. I've only been here for like six years and I don't leave the house. I don't like to. So, <laughs> uh, so yeah, there's uh, two locations. The, the pizza is fantastic. Now I've only tried the deep dish carnivore and I've tried it in the uh, small size and I've tried it in the individual size. And you know, they're both fantastic. Uh, I've not tried these fries. So what I'm gonna do right now, I'm gonna go ahead and try the fries for you. I can guarantee the pizza there is fantastic. The service is really nice. I always go to, I've only been to this, uh, I just took the lid off of this sauce. I've only been to this North Austin one at Gracie Farms, which is the little shopping center. I'm really hesitant with white sauces, but anyway, here's here's a manja fry, and it's sort of like a, a breaded fry. It's supposed to be their signature item. I'm gonna try it once without the sauce. It's a good like breaded fry. Um, it's a little spicy. I, I don't get fries a lot, to be honest with you. Um, and fries are good, don't get me wrong, but I don't know, they're, they're just, I don't really need fries, but like even with burgers, but sometimes I'll get them. Okay, I've got some sauce here. Yeah, actually it's a lot better with the sauce. I mean, it, they're fine without, but yeah, it's a good sauce. I don't know how to describe the sauce, it's like, it's a unique flavor. If you're daring about sauces, and I'm not, 
but it's good. It's good with the fries. It's good for dipping. You might you might like that better than ketchup, and I do usually use ketchup to dip my fries. But yeah, that, that was good. Okay, I'm going to show you the pizza now, uh, a slice of it. And close this fry box. You saw the pizza before. Here it is again. I know the lighting is very bright on top of it, but let me get a slice out for you. This is the Chicago style carnivore. And that's a slice there. Now the bottom layer, you've got the crust, and then you've got like um, some different meats there, uh, pepperoni and, and sausage, and I don't know what else they put in there. Then there's the marinara, and then there's Parmesan cheese I put on top of it because I like Parmesan. I like a lot of Parmesan if I'm eating anything Italian. That's just super good, man. That is so good. So this is Manja, North Austin. Try it out. It's pretty amazing. Um, the only pizza I like as much as now their small box doesn't say manja on it. It just says pizza. So this is what I have to show you the, the logo. But they sell t-shirts and stuff there, like a lot of local Austin places. The only pizza I like this much is the Alamo Draft House, uh, where I get the it's also called the carnivore, but it's not deep dish. So if I want deep dish, I'll go here. But if I well, when I'm going to see a movie, I always go to the Draft House, and I always get their carnivore. But yeah, um, <clears throat> yeah, I highly recommend Manja. If you're in Austin, Texas, if you're in North Austin, stop in there. I've only been to the Gracie Farms one, but it's really nice. Stop in and check it out. Manja Pizza. Okay, that's all, guys. I just wanted to give you a little review on that, and also. Um, my last post, which was a Sailor Moon Season 1 Crystal Season 1 unboxing, that one was kind of shoddy quality. It looked like the picture quality, and that was kind of sad because I wanted to show off that DVD, that Blu-ray set. Uh, that's because I uploaded it directly from my iPhone. I'm assuming that's why the quality was kind of shoddy. I really don't know. Um, hopefully this will come out better. <laughs> I really need to get a, a, an actual camera. I don't have a camera. I just use my iPhone for this right now. Um, tomorrow is Saturday, so I'm going to try to get my sister, uh, get together with my sister, and we're going to try to do a movie review. Um, I'll see if she's free. She's very busy. She does, she's in a band, so it's tricky. I do art, so that's not as hard. <laughs> okay, so I'll see you guys next time.